And now to present the high school level awards welcome from award sponsor AT&T, the regional director of external affairs from Rent and uh, Fred Maldonado. But for one second, you know, AT&T just announced a sponsorship for some little closed stadium over in Arlington. And so I'm thinking the correct introduction to uh, our next speaker is to say, and now, wearing number one, Fred Maldonado. Thank you, Jim, for that introduction. Uh, but you still owe me a drink uh, for me not goosing you when I walked up behind you, all right? For more than a century, AT&T has consistently provided innovative, reliable, high-quality products and services, and excellent, excuse me, improved excellent customer care. Today, our mission is to connect people with the world everywhere they live and work, and do it better than anyone else. AT&T is fulfilling this vision by creating new solutions for customers and driving innovation in the communications, technology, and entertainment industry. It is our company's desire to drive innovation and the need to train our future workforce that brings me the privilege of presenting the Tech Titan Future High School Level Award. This award recognizes a high school math or science teacher in the Metroplex for the development and implementation of an innovative teaching technique or program that inspires student interest regarding further education, educational and or career pursuits in science, technology, engineering, or math. The teaching technique or program must demonstrate opportunities for students to gain applied knowledge. The Tech Titan future high school level finalists are, and as I call your name, please join me here on stage. Chad Gillian, Richardson High School, Richardson ISD. The use of video lectures that students can view at home and then collaborate on assignments in the classroom is used by Chad Gillian to teach confidence in understanding how Math is used to solve everyday problems. His passion for math has likewise created students' excitement about STEM education, and his students' grades are the highest ever achieved. Clark Good, Bertner High School, Richardson ISD. Clark Good was named a finalist for inspiring students through the non-traditional method of using a recorded video lesson watched at home instead of doing traditional math homework. Sounds like it fit my schedule. The classroom is used for collaborative student practice where students receive individual attention. As a result, Berkner STEM students will start a dual credit college calculus class this fall at Richland College. Jose Guerrero, R.L. Turner High School, Carrollton Farmers Branch, ISD. Using a project-based learning format to engage and challenge students, Jose Guerrero makes the study of engineering and science relevant, vigorous, and fun for students using a project-based learning format. His impact has been significant and measurable with many of, the, of his graduating seniors now pursuing STEM education degrees in college. Our final finalist, Rami Mahmoud, Williams High School, Plano ISD. With a passion for science and learning, Rami Mahmoud has turned the classroom into a fun and entertaining way for his students to learn. Nominated for his use of video, online lectures, and QR codes that connect students to science in fascinating ways, he was also named Plano's 2013 Teacher of the Year. Yay. Okay, now to the good stuff. The winner will be presented a check. The winner will be presented a check for $4,000, and each of the finalists will be presented a check for $2,000 to be used in their classroom. Okay, and the Tech Titan future high school level winner is Chad Gillian, Richardson High School, Richardson ISD. Chad Gilead considers himself to be a facilitator of learning, not the holder of wisdom. He's a teacher, cheerleader, and mentor who has a passion for a student's success and uses tools like video instruction to prepare them for the jobs of the future. Uh, 
thank you uh, so very much um, to the MTBC. I'm so thankful to be up here, and I, I, I'm, th I'm so thankful to be working in Richardson ISD, who is, they, that district has helped me push the envelope. They've encouraged me to push the envelope to define the 21st century classroom. I'd really like to thank Clark Good, too. Uh, done the same thing that I've done. All teachers deserve this. Um, really like to thank Elizabeth Hart, our Excellence in Education Foundation, Mr. Duvall for being here with me, and my principal, Charles Bruner. Um, this is for, I, thank you very much.